What's up, everybody? This is episode 23 on the Nutri Air Show. I got my man Hungry Box in the fucking building. Let's How's it go. going? Good. I'm, I'm good. Yo, man, like, I've you know, I watched the Smash, the Smash documentary. That's what literally got me into Smash. So, like, give me, like, your, your like, quick background. Like, when you were, like, fucking a kid. I saw, I saw like, when you were a kid, like, this is, like, like let's go. So, yeah. like, give me, like, the, the origin story real quick. Uh... Honestly, just it was a, a pastime of ours. We started playing when we were like 12 years old, like me and Crunch, and we just started um, thinking we were really good, beating all of our friends. Went yep. to a few local tournaments, got destroyed, and then I I was just so competitive, I kept coming back. So one thing led to another. Next thing I know, I'm going to like national tournaments and traveling, and uh, here we are. What was like your first national? That you My remember? first national was probably the greatest military tournament since brawl came out. It was a Georgia regional, um, mm -hmm. and I beat Mutual King Cruz there. And uh, ever since then, I, I think tipped off four was my, my next official national. And I ended up getting second place there to Dark Rain. Yo, um, there's this thing where I remember you saying something along the lines where, like, it was very recently. I think it was, like, GTS or something. Someone, had, like, asked you to, like, play friendly. And you're like, yo, I don't play friendly. I, 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 I train with my teammate because this is, like, my job. So, like, give me some kind of, like, background. I, I, my, my context may not be right, but, like, give me, like, something along the No, it's more of, like... Top players, a lot of times, like, will play friendlies against each other. Like, Plup yeah. and Armada were warming each other up the entire time at GTX. Yeah. And that just gave Plup a bunch of knowledge that, yeah, exactly. on a matchup that he was struggling in. And the next thing you know, Plup is now beating Armada. Like, who's to blame there? Like, if you mm -hmm. want to play against, you know, friendlies against top players, by all means. But, like, with me, I know the fact that I, I kind of have a, a very strong, good stronghold on what it's like to be a, the, the top Puff player. And I have mm -hmm. a lot of, the last thing I want to do is, like, saturate all these top players with all my strategies and get used to me because the less they know about me the easier it is from exactly, so exactly. I'll, 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 I, that's why i don't play friends against them okay uh upcoming tournaments like where, where can we see you at uh frost but oh i'm already here yeah uh, full bloom uh <laughs> flat when iron, is that i never, I never... Full blooms in march in bloomington and then fly irons on april 20th in okay. uh, 420 in boulder colorado let's go and then um i'll be at smash and splash obviously there'll be a lot more announced here and there i'm going to smash valley next week so, see yeah. you of course Super Smash Go? Yeah. Uh, any any Sorry, any, yeah, any event that has a notability in Melee, I'll be there. Gotcha. Um, last question. Uh, what's, like, community mean to you, man? Like, Smash community in general? Like, um, That's a lot of things. I mean, I used to, I, sometimes I, I used to see it as a family, but now it's more of, like, um, I don't know. It's more of, like, a, it's, like, it's, like, a challenge for me now. It's, like, something that I have to overcome, especially in bracket, to win. Right, yeah. But it's my career. It's my life. And it's uh, something I've involved, created myself into since I was like ten years old, so yeah. So how did how did from like you you were a job as an engineer or something like something? Like that? Yeah, I was a chemical engineer, and I quit that after Liquid offered me a good enough contract where I could sort of live off Smash. Like, uh, yeah. Quick question for like people like for like sponsors, like like what are you looking for in a sponsor? Like, you want a sponsor that's gonna cater to your needs. You want a sponsor, just small sponsors and big sponsors. You just want to make sure you have someone who pays you what you are worth and not a penny below it. That's gotcha. the most important thing. And, if you, want, you know, if you want to go to a lot of tournaments, let them know. Express yourself. Express what you want from a sponsor and let them know if they can match it. But you have to earn it. Sponsor oh, yeah, definitely, man. will pay you what you're worth because you'll be on the camera more often if you're a brand. It's – and sometimes it's not just results, but I guarantee if you win every military tournament for a year, you're going to have a sponsor yeah, yeah, yeah. no matter what your personality I, is. I there. take a uh, liquid treat you really well. Yeah, yeah, they, 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 yeah, they, they uh, seem like an awesome sponsor. They made, they made me a full-time employee of the company now. So that's fucking awesome. I'm man. salaried with uh, with healthcare benefits and all that. So that's oh good. shit, that's cool. Yeah, yeah, it's good. Damn. All right, guys. Um, make sure you follow Hungry Box. You know, you know all his good stuff. Uh, check out that big ass Perler BIW man. That was fucking awesome when you came to my booth. Yeah, I took that picture of you. That was awesome. Yeah, I definitely have that picture on a lot of my social media. <laughs> yeah. And fun fact, um, he actually housed me. In this hotel yeah, let's go. last night. Smash Save my night, ass. baby. Let's go. Yeah, this guy's a homie. All right, guys. Appreciate it. Check out the channel and follow uh, Hungrybox. Peace out, guys. Yeah.